Good afternoon, this is Joe Vec Vick from CME Group here in Chicago. The wheat market traded both sides of unchanged here on Tuesday. USDA gave us a fresh set of weekly crop ratings on Monday afternoon, and it was kind of a mixed bag. We did improve slightly in the good to excellent category, but also saw a larger percentage of the wheat crop, the winter wheat crop, rated poor to very poor. So kind of some mixed signals from USDA. Now, the biggest thing surrounding action in the, in the wheat market this week is probably the weather forecast. We have a forecast for a very significant rain system to pass through the driest areas of the Southern Plains this weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. The driest areas of Texas, Kansas, Oklahoma should see very widespread coverage anywhere from an inch up to three inches of rain in a lot of these areas. Some of these areas haven't seen rain in months, so this uh, could very well be a drought busting event and has had a uh, particularly bad impact on the Kansas City wheat market, which has been under quite a bit of pressure here. One thing that should be noted, you know, when we have had these rallies in the wheat uh, on weather concerns, it seems like exports really start to fall off very quickly, and that's one of the problems with the U.S. wheat market. We just have a very, very tough time competing on the world market, and that's been the case here with this recent rally that we've seen. You know, as the market goes higher, we just seem to lose export demand very, very quickly. So it's another factor that may continue to cap rallies here. Again, Joe Vec from CME Group here in Chicago.